Today is a sad and angry day. I come, I come from England with my heartfelt sympathy and solidarity with the patriots of Germany. I'm not to Jen, yeah. <laughs> That's the problem. A lot of us think Tommy is serious. He's actually not. He's just a really convincing stand-up comedian. The Shavira pushes are here. <laughs> I mean, come on. No one can be that stupid on purpose. We are not far right. We are simply right. <laughs> Here I found Tommy Robinson doing his gig in front of his German fans. This is Deutschland, not Afghanistan! <laughs> you see, I told you, and it's not that bad. This is better than TV. I forgot me popcorn. <laughs> and hey, he's even got a translator. But he looks like someone who's not allowed to be near kids, if you know what I mean. And someone who doesn't know what toothpaste is. Why do I get the feeling he's gonna come in my nightmares and torment me? <laughs> alright, alright, maybe I'm giving him a hard time. Surely Tommy has selected someone who will do justice to his words of wisdom. I told you guys this was from Merkel, I don't translate. <laughs> <laughs> yes, perfect choice. In fact, I think he's overqualified. Tommy's crowd is very strange. I mean, I get it. I love tea. But these guys are taking it to another level. Tommy's talking about hating migrants and these guys are worried about tea bags. Now if that's not enough, suddenly the crowd starts confessing to Tommy. They think he's some sort of dodgy pope who likes tea bags. But that was not the end of Tommy's worries. This was the worst day for Tommy to decide to dress himself. He wore the big boy pants and he paid the price. Why do you keep pulling up your pants? That's only for people who have shame. You know when you're in front of thousands of people who see you as a leader and you have to make sure you're calm, composed and confident. But there comes a time when none of that matters mate because that wedgie just has to go. Now Tommy's got a big problem with the way Islam treats women. But hey, it seems like his crowd is segregated. This is what men must do. Have a look at this. But I can see men here and everywhere are waking up. According to this, apparently all the women are still asleep. It's our God-given right and duty of every man to protect our women. Or just waiting for a man to come and help them. Now towards the end, he ends up promoting lawlessness. We can no longer rely on the police or the government to protect our women. And trying his luck as a dodgy voodoo doctor. Islam is the cancer, Pegida is the cure. And after realizing he can't write properly and then tries to do a runner. It's common knowledge that Tommy Robinson uses crap to write his speeches. But every now and then comes a point where he's on stage but his crap runs out. So he has to top it up with a fresh batch. I'm sorry guys but we've reached the end of the journey of Tommy Robinson and the Germans. 
<laughs> if you think I mistranslated the German people and I'm spreading falsehood, but you cannot say the same of what Tommy's doing to the Quran, then you, my friend, have missed the entire point of the video. I'm gonna end with Tommy's favorite joke mate because this guy can actually speak his language we've been trying to communicate to him in proper english that doesn't work with our mate tommy and don't take the guy serious he's a comedian anyways guys until next time salamu alaikum i told you guys this is from merkel i don't translate <laughs>